Hi guys, this is Easterling Amanda and I'm here to talk about what happened in my previous video. Now, due to this whole quarantine lockdown epidemic that we're facing here in New York City, you know, we're not allowed to be within six feet of another person. So, you know, as a alternative, we decided to try to see if me and Laura could possibly chat each other and possibly do a rant from inside the house, which sounded like a good idea, but unfortunately it didn't work. We tried to do a rant that was almost eight minutes long, and it was, you know, it was talking about, it was talking about the, um, you know, this whole quarantine th thing that, that we're all facing right now. How we're all left cooped up in the house with absolutely nothing to do because they took all our entertainment away due to this virus. And, you know, people has been bored senseless with nothing to do. And like she said, you know, she said, you know, you can only do things for a certain amount of time before you find yourself getting bored. And it's the truth. Because, you know, you, you don't want to be inside the whole time. I mean, yeah, sure, sometimes you got to relax your body from being out most of the time. And that's all well and good. And that's understandable. But at the same time, it's like, you know, you got to go outside and get some air. You got to do that. They allow you to do that, but you got to be your, by yourself as part of social distancing. So, you know, a lot of people is not taking it too well. And I'm not 100%, but I'm making the best of it as day goes by. Like, when I video chat with my friends and when I, you know, talk, when I talk to my babe, me and my babe talk. And then things, you know, then we start to, like, you know, wish that we could go places. And it's, it starts to hit you. You know, it, start, it, starts to, it starts to drain you mentally sometimes. It, start, it really starts to bother you. Even when you say, don't let things get to you, don't let things bother you. But how much long can you take before you know before you explode before you before you start saying okay enough is enough you know it's it gets frustrating and you know I felt good because I got to video chat with my sis and at least when we video chatted we took lots of pictures all the, like we always do when we're together so that was a good thing but the disappointing part was in my previous video if you guys already seen it the only problem is you cannot hear a sound. My sound is out. Like I tried using the app called Mobizen, the app that I use to um to react to different video games, trailers and stuff like that, which I'm gonna slowly get back into. But it's like I guess because of the fact I was already inside a chat and my and the microphone was used inside a chat, it couldn't do that for the app. It was disappointing, and you know, it's kind of how do you say? It's very, in my case, is is it's a disappointment and almost depressive life. But you know what? I'm gonna see if I could just try to continue doing what I gotta do. You know, whatever I can do, because there's not really much I can do with this pandemic except all I can do is personally rant. Because if I wanted people to rant with me, the only person who could rant with me right now was my babe. I live with my babe, which is a good thing. But most times my babe will say, you know, the ranting is for you and Laura. Or personally, if you have a rant, you rant, it's, it's, for, it's for you. If he has something he would want to rant about, he would rant with me. Or if we have found something that we want to try together, we would do it in future videos where you see us trying new foods, us trying new snacks, and all this other stuff. But sometimes it's like what the... With the limited of, with the limited stuff that we're able to do, it's so hard, and it's almost making me feel like I have to put my channel on hold, and I don't want to put my channel on hold. But you guys, all you guys who sit here and watch my videos, I appreciate that. All you guys who sat there and subscribed and told your friends about me to subscribe to my channel and help my channel grow, I appreciate that. You know what I'm saying? There's only so much you can do with this. With this quarantine, you, you can't really do much. And it's, it's, you know, now I have to start literally brainstorming things. I mean, I can still review game trailers because I've been doing that too. I can, re I can still view, I can still, um, yeah, react to game trailers and stuff like that. But the new snacks, unfortunately, I have to put that on hold unless I order it. 
And, you know, with this thing here, you can't go outside and everything you gotta order, you gotta do it online. And, you know, phones are running low, so I can't even do that right now. I have to be limited to the things that I want to get. If I want to go somewhere, I have to go there early in the morning. Because now, we have, how do you say it? We have a curfew now. So now, everybody has to be home by 8 o'clock. After that, everything is shut down. So what really can you do? That's what I'm asking. Like, what really can you do? There's absolutely nothing left to do. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to continue praying and hoping for better days. Because I've been doing good so far. So far, so good. I've been doing good. But you guys, let me know how are you taking this epidemic right now. Are you hanging in there? Are you feeling like you're about to snap? Let me know which one it is in the comments below. We can talk about it because, you know, this is, this will start, you know, to bother you mentally. It has affected me once. And it almost, I almost got there a few other times. But it affected me a few already. How long can you hold on before you're ready to be like... It's done you know just let me know exactly how you're handling your situation right now and if you guys can come up with other ideas that would help me also future my channel while dealing with this predicament I will gladly take ideas from you guys let me know what you think what do you think I should do to try to keep myself occupied and what can keep my channel going because I am trying my best, guys. I am really, really trying my best, and it drives people insane. It drives me nuts that I can't even hear my last video that I just recorded. And I, and it's, it's crazy because I felt that was the last result that I had, that me and her could rant. And it worked until I played it and watched it, and there was no sound. So, guys, I'm open to anything. Let me know what you want to see in my in the future of my channel the bigger my channel goes the more I'll be able to do for you guys but I need you guys help be sure to tell people more about my channel tell them to subscribe share my videos whatever just continue help me helping you okay thank you guys for watching I appreciate it and I will continue to do it as best I can thank you guys for watching this is Easterling Amanda saying bye guys